What's up guys, Pedguin here, back again with another Terraria update video. I say back again, when was the last time I actually made a Terraria update video? I think it was 1.3 when I seriously started doing them. So yeah, it's been a long time. A lot of you guys know why I, you know, stopped making update videos and I, I've mentioned it on Twitch and on Twitter, you, you've seen it. Um, essentially, I'm on the beta team for t Terraria, um, so I can see the next updates and stuff like that. Um, so I kind of get like a sneak peek before you guys. Um, but I, you know, I try and, you know, take a blind eye sometimes, so it's like a surprise to me. And then sometimes I just, you know, I just gotta look, you know. <laughs> um, but, you know, it's, it's a lot of fun. Um, but... I'm, I'm not going to be addressing anything new, obviously, that you've not seen, because I cannot do that. I'll break an NDA, but I can talk about the things that exist. And from the things that exist, I can probably say, I'll, I'll you know, I'll, I'll mention this in the future of the video too. I can say um, that 2019 is probably going to be a huge year for Terraria. From all the updates we've seen, the minecart, for example, the minimap borders, the oasis, the... Thanksgiving food sprites, the block swap, the cowboy set, the blood moon enemy, the tree animation with the wind and the music and everything like that. It's going to be huge, right? I think it, it's going to be the biggest update since 1.3 and that's huge saying, right? Um, and there's a lot of reasons I think this. Of all of the updates in from like 1.1, 1.2, 1.3, 1.4, 1.5, none of them come close to what we've even been spoiled, right? I'm going to go through them in a moment, um, but they don't come anywhere near to what we have on the table already. And that's just spoilers. That doesn't include everything we don't know. That's insane, right? So in this next portion of the video, I'm going to use the Terraria Gamepedia to show you exactly what I mean. I'm going to show you every single update after Terraria 1.3, and then I'm going to compare it to the new upcoming features in Terraria 1.3.6. And it's going to blow your mind. It's going to get you so excited for the future. And to be honest, I'm, I'm really excited too. 2019 is going to be a blast for Terraria. All right, so Terraria 1.3.1, the wiring update. We all remember this, right? It added large gems, it added wiring, and it added treadmills and stuff like this. This was thought to be a massive update, and to be honest, it kind of was. Um, it, 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 you know, it took a new level to custom maps. It was probably the biggest update so far after Terraria 1.3, um, but it didn't really have that much effect to be honest with you. Like, look at all these things they added, and all of this stuff changed the game in a really interesting way, but it didn't change the game in terms of content. It didn't add any new enemies, new bosses, new, you know, sort of stuff like this. What players that play Terraria come to expect from an update, this is for the nerds, you know what I mean? Um, but you know, I feel like this didn't change the game as, as people thought it was going to, which kind of sucked. I, I, I hoped it changed the game a bit more but, you know, one of my personal favorite updates, but just didn't hit the mark for the most of the community. Up next, um, Terraria 1.3.2. Um, this update, very small one. This was for the anniversary of Terraria. And look, they had a, you know, they added like a bouncy castle, bouncy blocks, that sort of stuff. They added Pedguid outfit. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. And, you know, just that sort of stuff. Very small update. Not much going on. Um, but yeah, a cute little update. Terraria 1.3.3. Another nice update. They enhanced the desert in this update. They added some vanity stuff. They added shark, sand sharks, sharknadoes, um, and a new armor set and stuff like that. A very small update once again, but, you know, still pretty good. Up next, Terraria 1.3.4. Um, so this was probably the biggest update next to the wiring one in terms of, it depends what you're going for. If you like wiring, the wire one's b bigger for you. If you like, you know, fighting bosses and that sort of stuff, this one's a big one for you. Terraria 1.3.4. This one, in my opinion, was hit or miss. Um, it was a really good update, you know, with the, um, as you can see. Uh, Old One's Army, you know, had all these little mini bosses. It had Betsy the Dragon, the, the Ogre, all this sort of crazy stuff. And that was a lot of fun. It really was a lot of fun. It had new armor sets. But, gonna be honest, after one playthrough of this, it got boring. Gonna be honest, it got real boring. If you had to, to get an armor set, you had to fight these waves like six times. Who, who's gonna do that? 
in multiple playthroughs, right? You're going to do it one time to get the armor set, have some fun. And if you're going to go through another playthrough, are you going to touch this? No, you're not going to touch this because it's really, really boring. And that's just my opinion. I'm sure some people like it, but I honestly think this update, when it hit, boom, people loved it. They loved it. It was really fun, but it got tiring really quick. It got old very fast. And it was kind of sad because I we all had a lot of high hopes for this update. Um, but it was good at the time, let's be honest. Moving on, Terraria 1.3.5, another small update, but in terms of community, it mattered a lot. This added new languages, um, added, you know, simplified Chinese as a language, it added, you know, Polish, Brazilian, Russian, Spanish, German, Italian, French, all the languages. Um, so I, I could say, you know, that, it, that it's a small update because I'm English. Um, and I, you know, my, the English language has always been there, um, but for everyone outside of England and America, this is a huge update for those guys. So, yeah, another not so, you know, not, not, not a hit or miss, I guess, once again. Um, hit for the English, uh, hit for the people outside of England, and then miss for everyone else, because they didn't really get much except some, like, vanity stuff, right? Um, so, now, remembering all these, 1.3, 1.1, 1.2, 1.4, 1.5, all of these. Now compare it to what we've been told so far about 1.3.6. Let's have a look, shall we? Boom! Terraria 1.3.6. Um, look at look at this. Look at this list. Look at this. Look at this list compared to everyone else. This is the list for 1.1. Look at the list for 1.2. Look at the list for 1. We don't even know. We don't even know half the stuff yet. And look at this list. Just by looking at this list, are you not hyped? Are you not hyped? What? Like, that's crazy. Even, even this update, it's tiny. It's teeny tiny compared to what we've got so far. And the, the best part about this is this isn't just stuff in a single area. It's not like, oh, we made, you know, we added an oasis to the desert and then that's it. It's stuff all over the place, and you can bet your bottom dollar that they're going to update a bit more than they're saying, right? Let's go through some small things. Um, you know, the cowboy set. This, the, you think they're just going to add one vanity set to the game? You think they're just going to add a cactus toilet to the game and that's it? You think they're just going to add a mine... Carp to the game, <laughs> what? And and that's it. They're totally gonna be like adding on this sort of stuff. Um, oh, I'm so excited. Oh, this is gonna be good. Look at all of this stuff. Oh my goodness, I did show you this earlier. The oasis, new food items, the new enemies. You think they're just gonna add one enemy? Um, new animation of the star cannon. Pew! Look at that. So cool. Oh my goodness, and look at this. This right here, the block swapping, that's a game changer right there. This little UI changes. You think they're just going to do one little UI change? I think you, you, mate, I'm so excited. This makes me so excited. Oh my god. Look how big this list is before, before we've even started. I'm sorry I'm going on a bit of a tangent right now, but this is huge in my opinion. Um, if you guys aren't excited for Terraria 1.3.6 or... Terraria 2019, the year of Terraria. You've got another thing coming. Because this is going to be huge for content creators. You know, I've been, you know, I haven't been uploading that much. And to be honest, I think my, my New Year's resolution is going to be like upload a video like every day. I'm going to, I'm, I want to, cool, cool. I want to get excited. I want to, I want to get involved in this sort of stuff. I'm very excited. Um, I just got to make sure to juggle the beta correctly because I don't want to like spoil it all, but I do want to see more at the same time. Oh, so exciting. But anyway, thank you very much for watching this video, guys. I appreciate it. You guys rock it. You guys are cool. You guys are fantastic. I appreciate you guys supporting me, even though I haven't uploaded in a while. I hope you guys can still appreciate a video where it's just me rambling for long periods of time. Um, we'll see. <laughs> I'll check the statistics. 1% retention ra ratio. Oh no! But we'll see. Um, for those of you that don't know, I am part of the Yogs cast now. Um, and I am going to the Jingle Jam uh, tomorrow. So that's cool. Um, so if you guys want to watch that, uh, I'll provide a, you know, I'll, I'll do a little bit of a write up in the comments or something. But 
I just want to say thank you guys so much. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. 2019, year of Terraria. I'm excited. And, uh, yeah. I appreciate it, guys. Like, comment, all that sort of stuff. Give me your speculations, honestly. Um, I miss reading some thoughtful comments. I don't want... I, I can't bother to read. First, second, when are you playing Terraria? Like, I... I some thoughtful comments, please. <laughs> Do you miss me? Plus. Um, anyway, thanks guys. Peace. Catch you later. Bye.